course, it's the woman's fault for marrying a scrub and not the man's fault for being one. Let me ask you a question. Do you think he advertised that he was a scrub before she got into a relationship with him? Or do you think he pretended to be everything she ever wanted? Do you think she spent her childhood dreaming of one day marrying a man who claimed that he didn't know how to do the dishes and couldn't remember to take out the trash? Or do you think it's more likely that he only revealed who he was after she had already fallen in love with who he was pretending to be? Because if that's true, then how do you blame her for picking wrong if she didn't know who she was picking? She thought she was marrying husband of the year, so it's not like she went out looking for the husband that no one wanted. And you have no idea what happened to her self-esteem when she met him. Because bad husbands have a way of making you believe that you don't deserve anything good. So maybe she sat there blaming herself for the shift in him when that's really who he always was. You act like you would have told her to give up when she realized, but I'm pretty sure you would have told her that she gave up too easily if she had. Women are conditioned to honor their commitments, so they sit there hoping that if he changed for the worse, then he can also change back for the better. I can guarantee you that no woman will intentionally pick a man who hurts her. But sometimes you don't know what it is until you're in it. And you can go ahead and consider yourself lucky for never being in that situation. But I don't think there's anything cute about shaming women with bad partners just because you were fortunate enough to find a better one.